On this episode of Black Tip H, we're here in Cocoa Beach with Captain Jamie from Fin and Fly Charters, and we're fishing for black drum. How big are these black drum? Let's just put it this way. The smallest we've been getting is in the 30 pounds, but most of them have been from 40 up to low 60s, sometimes even 70 pounds. Dude, that's ginormous. My biggest black drum right now is around five pounds, so I got a good feeling we're gonna break my PB today. Perfect. I mean, it's oh, it's beautiful. You don't get to see a lot of days like no. this on the, on the ocean exactly. this time of the year. Exactly. Jamie, I'm gonna send the drone up right now, yep. and we're gonna go look for those drone with the drone. I think that's a huge advantage oh, over just trying to see them on the boat. It, it's the biggest advantage you could possibly have. Nobody will have the eyes like we have today. It's like having our own personal frigate bird, our, our own personal helicopter. Exactly. <laughs> fish with a drone. I gotta get me one of these now. Yeah, now you see the advantage, right? Yeah, bird's eye view, baby. We had the drone in the air and we saw a huge school of black drum on the beach. So we're about 100 yards off the beach and they're right here. We're gonna throw these little jigs and we're gonna bounce them on the bottom and hopefully we get a bite. Oh my gosh, look at those drums. Look at those drums, dude. Fish on? Fish on. Go, go underneath me, go underneath me. Oh, pulled off. I think that. There we go. This shot. Double dump. Yeah. Double dump. You're double dump. Look at, look at. Who that fish? Look at mine's on the surface. There's so oh. many fish here. He's running it's into insane. all the fish. Oh, mine just popped. Oh wait. Oh, he still got him. Let's look at that fish. Look at that. Big black That's my new personal best right there. Dude, oh, hey, mine the just popped off. Can you get the net, dude? Look at that black drum, guys. Woo! New personal best right there. That's only like a 12 pounder too. Yeah, this isn't this isn't giant. We saw ones in there that were four times the size, but this is a great fish to start the day off with. Look at these whiskers underneath them, right here. You can hear them drumming, guys. I can hear them. It's making noises. Awesome, good release, man. That was awesome. All right, grab that rod. That Let's get awesome. another one. Let's catch another one. Dude, they're right here. I'm gonna throw a cast in. Go. You got one? Yeah. Got one. That's a bigger one right there. Oh yeah, he's not even turning. That's why we got these heavy, extra, extra heavy tear marks. Oh, he just broke me off in the school. Yep. There's so many fish, guys. This is nuts. Josh saw a post I did on Instagram and was like, dude, bro, those are massive. Dude, look at these fish. They're right there. Look at them, dude. Look at the size of some of those fish. Oh, that's a big one. This one's bigger. <laughs> <laughs> and you got fish in line around. Dude, this is a mess. You just keep fighting your fish. Don't worry about what I'm doing. This might be one of those 70 pounders, dude. He feels extremely heavy. I'm gonna tighten the drag down a little bit. All right, you want you want to use a trolling motor to get, to get up on them? All right. This one's big, man. So I have to ask, what's what's the biggest black drum you've ever caught well, on a trip? Well, when I I actually started taking people. I mean, you can't get your captain's license until you're 18. And I bought my first John boat when I was 17, and then I got my first flat boat when I was 18. But when I was 17, me, my best friend John, um, and a, an, an old guide, he was a part-time guide, um, Norm Dulong, and we caught one that was probably 75 pounds. Really? And let me tell you this, fishing the pilings under bridges, oh my God, it's like dude. tight quarters. You gotta be using like, we use basically bottom fishing reels where you have like no drag, just like when you do the Goliath groupers. Yeah. I mean, and the thing just fought and fought and fought and fought and fought. And we, I mean, we were just going around pilings, just trying to get them out of there and we got them out of there. I got I've got the photo somewhere dug up. I got a feeling we got a 50 pound fish on here right now, dude. I think we're getting close here, dude. Yep, just keep that tight. Is that net ready? Yeah, the net's right there. 
dude. Look at him I down love, there. Dude. Yeah, he's a, he's a stud. You talk about fishing days in those epic, epic trips. This is one of them. How did you get him on that fin? I can't go in by tail. No. Here we go. Oh, oh we got him. <laughs> dude, it's giant. <sighs> The slime, I will take Hear him it. drumming? Yeah, I do, bro. Doom, 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 doom. Oh my gosh, he barely fits in the net, guys. Here, I'm nice. gonna get my look, camera, too. Look at that fish! Hear him drumming? <laughs> oh, he's ginormous! That's how it's done, son. Guys, this fish weighs about 35, 40 pounds. It's ginormous. Oh my gosh, it's so big. Look at this. There he goes. Woo! You're welcome. That's incredible. Dude, that's incredible. Yeah, boy. So, Jamie, if people want to catch black drums, what's the best lure and bait to use? Well, we like to use jigs, like what we were using today, um, soft plastics. Um, they work great, especially on the flats, but out here, mainly the jigs. Um, they're big on crustaceans also, shrimp, crabs, sand fleas, um, and clams. You know, those, those work. Blue crabs is the yeah. specialty. Really? So that's yeah. your favorite food, blue crabs? Uh, not always, you know, they can be picky. I mean, sometimes they'll only eat shrimp, sometimes it's clams, sometimes it can be sand fleas. I take it these fish are highly migratory species. I mean, they, they look like they're moving pretty fast. Absolutely, man, absolutely. They've been here for a couple weeks now, which is really cool. Um, usually it's like they're here for a couple days and they're gone. So, so like, do you know how far they go? I mean, do they, do they uh, travel they, hundreds of miles? Yeah, they tagged one uh, a couple years ago in the lagoon and it traveled and they re-caught it and a couple months later, in the Chesapeake. Wow. Yeah. So these are highly migratory species. Absolutely. They're you, literally, if you're not out here looking for them, yep. this is this is this is why I'm so glad you called me, dude. Because <laughs> this is why you need a guide, guys. Because I'm telling you, if, if you just come out here and just try to wing it, it's just, it's really really hard. You got you got to be with someone that's dialed into the fish, fishery because otherwise, like you said, like they could be here today and they could be 30 miles south the next day. So you got to stay on top of the fish. And the only people that can do that are the guides, local guides. There we go. Oh, dang. Got one? Hooked up. All right, Jamie's got one. Oh, fish ran into it again. Oh, there's a giant there, dude. There's, there's, there's 60 pounders in there. Oh, yeah, for sure, 100%. Fish on? Just like that, hey? Yep. <laughs> they almost look like redfish. Real, real, fast, 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 real. Real, 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 real. Let it sink, let it sink right there. Oh, oh, double oh, no. oh no, oh no, where's your line though? Dude, this is why we fish, man. This is one of those banner days, dude. Bro, guys, so Jamie called me yesterday. He's like, dude, they're here. Like, well, I, no, I was we, gonna, dude, I was gonna sit in the, in the office all day and do paperwork, and then he told me the fish were biting. Not happening. All right, watch your line. See mine? Yeah, see yours. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah Pull yeah. them down low. Pull yours low. Mine's over top. All right, all right, all right we're right, good. We're right. good. Right. Angling skills 101 right there, bro. Woo! This is going to be there fun netting them now. It's in the school again. Yeah, that's the problem, man, is getting them out of that school. I mean, you saw I, I lost three fish and broke off in there. And this is 60 pound leader. This is so awesome. Dude, this is crazy. This is unbelievable. Look at, look at the lure, right in the corner. Dude, that's a giant, bro. That's another 40 pounder. He almost looks like a redfish. Like, look look, look how gold he is. Oh, They're God. giant, dude. We got two giants. Is yours in the corner, too? Oh, yeah. Look at that. All right, mine's good. How was yours? Mine's, mine's good, dude. All right, this is going to be interesting trying to land these. Dude, yours is definitely bigger than mine. <sighs> oh, good. Here, grab this rod and just pull it back. Here, here and give, then... it, give it to me. Yep. Nice and easy. Oh, yours inhaled it. All right, one. Get yours in there. Get okay, ready. Uh, two. Go in the net. Giants, dude. Giants. Oh, you hear them drumming? Double header, guys. Look at these black drums. These are giants. Monsters. All right. Oh, my gosh, dude. This is awesome. Let's get them back in the water. <laughs> Let's release them, dude, right here. Oh, there goes mine. There, there goes, goes yours. yours. Josh, Bro, yeah, that's awesome, dude. Bro, how, how insane is that, guys? Double header, 30 plus pound black drum. Here, watch this, and within 30 seconds? We're gonna hook another one right now, watch this. Right here, ready? I'm out of wind. I've only caught one. 
I can keep going all day long, all day long. Ready, guys? <laughs> well, you don't get to do it every day. Actually, that one actually, I think, kind of bent my hook. Oh, did you just hit a bite? Oh, man. Yeah, we gotta get back in school. They're moving south really all fast. Right. Yep. You'll never get drone footage of black drum in this clean of water, I guarantee you, probably ever again. I, I, I've never, in my whole life, we get these drum every year. But I've never seen it where the water is crystal gin clear here. This is a rare phenomenal, phenomenon already. There we go. Fish on. There you go, Josh. Oh, man. And they're just still circling. Oh, we're got, it's the power. It's amazing. <laughs> look, at, look at the donut they're doing. I know. That was what my fish was. He just made a donut. No, I'm saying, like, see how there's no fish in the middle? It's just a, it's crazy. Okay, get the net, bro. Right. Never mind. He's not ready. Is this your third? This is my fourth, dude, I think. Yeah, this is your fourth. We got a double. He's a giant, you got dude. one snagged. You caught that small one. And then this one. Giant, dude. Dude, this thing is just dude, a stud. Look and look different. how clear this water is. I'm just like... Look at the hump on him. Yeah. In the net, baby. That's a big one, bro. That's, yeah, that's a stud. That 45 might be... pounds. Might be 50. <sighs> how heavy you think he is? They're, they're all That's high 30s, enormous, mid 40s, dude. dude. Oh. This is look awesome. That monster, guys. That's just, look at it. Look, he's just a stud, dude. Total it's stud. Enormous. Look, look at the knot on him right here. This is, this it's is like cool. a peacock, giant peacock bass. Releasing the beast. Look at that fish. Look, look, look how clear that is, though. Clear water or dirty water. That's a giant fish. I'm getting tired, but I'm not gonna stop catching them. I can't, this is, this is addicting. So Jamie, how long have you been guiding on the waters in Cape Canaveral? Uh, I was 13 years this year, actually. Wow. Yeah, it's, it's been a while. You know, I started this company back in, just before I was turning 18, was when I got my captain's license. I fell in love doing it ever since, expanded the business now. You know, we've got two flats boats running full time. We've got this Skeeter Bay boat. And uh, hopefully this spring, you know, we're, or the beginning of summer, we'll have, you know, we're looking at like an open express sport fisher, wow. single diesel. So you're going way offshore. Yeah, doing the offshore stuff. You know, I've got myself guiding uh, Captain Alex Huey, and we're bringing on board uh, Captain Nate Brady. You caught four? We got, oh, no, we got, I got five. five. We got, we got five, five giant, monstrous black drum. And you know what the crazy thing is? As, 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 as hard as those things fight, yeah. and as big as they are, and as tired as we get, I can't stop catching them. You I mean, feel them right. Is, you feel it right here in the floor. Dude, it's it's everywhere. It, those things are n ginormous, dude. Yeah. And they pull drag. They're, there's nothing you can't sight, say. Sight fishing We're them. We're using artificial. artificial lures. We're sight fishing them. Dude, I say we get some killer drone shots now. What do you think? Absolutely. Let's do it. Fish on! Woo! <laughs> Fish on, baby! Doubled up! Unless you're on my fish. No. Woo! Yeah, boy. Oh, watch our fish. <laughs> Are we fighting the same fish? No, we're not, dude. Okay, no. Mine's over here. Yours is there. Okay. With his dog. This is a giant right here, dude. Oh, I got you, dude. Actually, maybe, maybe not, maybe not. Oh, look at mine right here at the back. Uh, yours is way under here. I know. You ready? I'm gonna bring it around this here side. Here we go, mine's here, mine's here. Here we go, dude. All right, hold my rod. One. <laughs> oh, pull it, pull it. <laughs> oh, baby. Big <laughs> black drum. <laughs> Woo, dude, this, this is, is uh, what it's about right here, yeah. man. <laughs> oh. All right, let's get him back in the water. There goes yours. All right. There goes mine, dude. Great release. That was awesome, man. Double header, second of the day. Drone video, I hope you like it.
I came up here to catch my personal best black drum. We did it like seven times in a row. Dude, it was unreal. One of the best sight fishing days of my life. Can't thank you enough. Captain yeah. Jamie, Finn and Fly Charters, check these guys out. Hope you guys enjoy this video, and we'll see you next time. Peace. Black Tip H Fishing is brought to you by Frog Tongs, designed for you, created for the outdoors, and Sudacore Nutrition.